darkest roads and up in the clouds But I've always felt that something's missing That was until I found you right there in the crowd You came into my life and started a fire Hello everybody, welcome back to the Campo Chronicles here on day two of our trip and yeah, that's only like five more days until we hit the seven night Disney cruise. But here first, we're here at Epcot for the Festival of the Arts. Jackson and Laurel, what are you most excited for today? I'm what? most excited for Ratatouille. Ratatouille, I can't wait. That line was a little long when we came in, huh? Might have to wait, because we're staying at a deluxe property, so we get to stay here an extra two hours while everybody else has to go home. All right, Jackson, what are you most excited for? Probably the space ride. Mission space? Yeah. First, we're gonna go do Soaring Around the World, and then we'll see what else we can do, because there's Festival of the Arts stuff, there's a lot of art. I think we might head over there, do some test track and mission space. We'll see, we're gonna have a lot of fun either way. I'm also excited for all the food booths today. We're gonna try a lot of new foods. Yeah! Nope. Yeah! Since today we do not have the Genie Plus going, we're kind of going to be hitting things as we go. Starting first, they were only calling 20 minutes for mission space, so kids want to knock that one out. Can't find a time where I can tell ya what I feel now. Been biting my tongue for a while, the words just want to come out. I'm too afraid to be rejected, it's so expected. I feel like I'm out of my mind, but I know I can't deny. Thank you. 
All right, of course, Mission Space is a lot of fun, but now that we've all gone on it, including our Switch Riders, Laurel, what are we gonna do next? We are going to go on Figment. That's right, Figment. We're gonna go over to Journey of Imagination, but first we're gonna stop by and let the kids try Club Cool and see if they like that Beverly. If you don't know, Club Cool is a place where you can drink sodas around the world. This one is Country Club. It's for so let's start with the Italy. <laughs> the person down there is like barbecue. You're in last place. Alright, Jackson's not a big fan of the Beverly, but here we go. Yep, that's gross. That's disgusting. Yep. I'm gonna I'm trying the Korea. I'll try the beach. That's good. It's way better. Royal Wata melon from Philippines. It's a strong watermelon. Yeah. It's like drinking a Jolly Rancher. I'll do it like a soda I taste. Can't come and not try it. Oh, this one is so good. Oh, yeah, it definitely smells. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa. 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 That is Which way too bad? bitter. Yeah. Now the Gaston, come back. Now for the ultimate challenge the suicide of from around the world. Oh. That's it. Push it. Oh. Push it. Good. Push it. Good. Push it. Push it. Push it. Push it. Push it. Push it. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Alright, from around the world. Oh, you can still taste the Beverly. But surprisingly, you can still get some of that coconut from Madagascar. I need a napkin. Oh. Here at this family, we've come to realize that you can't really go to Disney World and Epcot without going on Journey to the Imagination with Figment. But you've got it wrong, Doc. It's not about listening with your ears. It's about listening with your imagination. <laughs> With your you can see things differently. Great idea! We'll go to my open house instead! It's much more fun! Right this way, everybody! We just painted part of this blue figment. As you can see, yeah, that's the regular figment, and then it goes out onto the other colored figment. And this is a bookmark of what the finishing touches are. You, you only get six squares to color in, and you are, you are assigned a specific number, and you have to color in six of those numbers. Then, when everyone has a chance to do it, it'll look like this.
is starting our Eating Around the World Now Pop Arts. We got grilled cheese with tomato soup and we got the Pops Art, not the Pop Tart, the Pops Art cookie. All right, let's go ahead and give this Pops Art cookie a shot here. We'll do the break. Ooh, that's nice. That's soft. There's chocolate inside. It's okay. Very sugary, almost chalky, but still, still good. All right, we're gonna give the tomato soup a shot here. That's okay. It's not as good as Disney Cruise tomato soup, though. I will say it's good. it's good, but not that great. I've had better. From the refreshment port, we got the ganoshi poutine, and it is red wine soaked braised beef, cheese curds. I'm gonna get all three together. Wow. Those flavors mixed together are amazing. Braised beef is so juicy. You can tell it was marinated really, really well. So good. I wouldn't skip this one. We just stopped over at the uh, food station for over in the French Pavilion and we got a few things. We got the chocolate croissant, we got the molten lava cake, and we also got the bread cheese bowl. And we are very excited to try these. Good? Yeah. Yeah, that's so good. Yeah? So good. Uh, I don't think it's actually that good, but... Eh. Looks over at the American Pavilion. We're trying the food here now. We got the beef wellington, we got the scallops, and the pistachio cake. Let's give them a shot. Going for the scallops first. That uh, looks amazing. Good scallops. I really don't think they need the sauces on the side though. Just trying all of them and it's not that great. Scallops themselves though, really good. All right, so time for the beef wellington. That beef is really good. I like the beef and the gravy. That's really good. Now time for the pistachio cake. Let's see if it comes even close to what we had on the Disney Cruise. Dip in a little cherry sauce on the side. It's good. It is good. But it's not as good as Disney Cruise cake. Out of the three, the beef lunch is the best. I know pistachio cake is a dessert and the other two are entrees or appetizers even, but pistachio cake was good. It was because it's sweet. It's naturally good, but I had to pit them against each other. Beef Wellington wins. We're waiting for Harmonious now. It's only five minutes away. Not gonna have the best seats, but I'm pretty sure we'll still be able to see plenty. was awesome. I was not expecting it to be as cool as it was. I really did appreciate the different cultural flares that it brought to the table. The songs in some of the native languages, if you will. That was really cool. And now we're in line for Ratatouille. And this is going to be our first time on it. We just didn't want to wait the hour and a half plus during normal business hours, but since the park is closed now, now is a good chance. Let's go have some fun on Ratatouille. But first, Emily, how did you like Harmonious? Favorite part about Harmonious was uh, the music. I love how they took classic songs from the movies, but then sang it in that the correct language of whatever the, the culture or country it's from. I thought that was a lot of fun. I really liked that. How did you like Harmonious? It was so good. And Jackson, are you excited for Ratatouille? You better think I am.
invité pour le dîner. Yes, but what to prepare? No. A simple omelette? Too simple. Voilà. Mais oui, that's it. That was pretty cool. Is it the best and most technologically advanced ride? No, probably not, but the fact that they made you feel like you were a rat, a small rat in a big kitchen was pretty cool. There were many times where you felt small and you felt like you were just this rat in a kitchen. I don't know how to explain it. Last ride, we're gonna go hit up Frozen real quick. The girl's gonna go, so yeah, let's go do Frozen real quick. It's across the park. Our dogs are barking, but we're ready. Let's go for a walk. Okay, that was fun. So Remy Ratatouille said 60 minutes, we probably waited maybe 30, and Frozen said 20 minutes, we probably made it maybe 10. It was really fast, but because of all the walking we had to do, that was pretty much our two hours. So it's been fun, guys, and what a long day. We were here early and we stayed late. We are tired, but tomorrow is Hollywood Studios, so stay tuned for that. And then after that, we have a day off with some great dining reservations planned. For now, guys, we're gonna go ahead and sign off Thanks again for watching. If you found anything of value today, if we helped you at all, definitely consider liking and subscribing to our channel. Thanks again for watching, guys. We'll see you real soon. And remember, adventure is out there.